Shut up and sit down. All right, guys, guess who's back? Hey. Um, I'm Andy. I'm Dodge. This is Big Mac's workshop and paint studio. And after an entire year of uploading nothing, we finally decided to reshow our faces. Yeah, obviously, uh, this last couple of years have been pretty painful for everybody. Um, we had the plague times, which was uh, about as much fun as stabbing yourself in a leg. Yeah. And the backlash and that as well. Uh, so we had to take some time for for ourselves, really. Yeah. Um, uh, we've got, there's a lot of backlash with that, actually. Like, it's just a knock-on effect. And yeah. Life getting in the way. Um, like, we made 10,000 subscribers. Yeah. Even though we've not been uploading for about a year. So that's pretty cool. Yeah, definitely. That's awesome. So thanks, guys, for uh, continuing to watch our videos. Um, and support the channels. We still had a bunch of patrons that were still paying us. Um, and we just sent them all a message saying we're not uploading at the moment. <laughs> don't don't give us your money. Yeah. Um, we, but, we, we were honest about it. You know, we all front we said, look, we're not going to be uh, for the foreseeable. We're not going to be making videos. So we collapsed Patreon um, and we just left things sort of new, in neutral. Uh, whilst we uh, got ourselves in a position where we could start um, making videos again, even if it's on a slightly different... Sort of, um... a slightly different style, maybe. Um, yeah. uh, anyone who's edited videos, if you're just someone who watches stuff on YouTube, you won't know how much effort goes into making any one of these tutorials that we make. You're going to spend days painting the model and capturing the footage, then, you know, a day or so editing all that down and the audio and then putting every single one of the paints on the uh, thing it takes a lot of days and then sometimes the video just flops and you barely even get a thousand views on it in like a month and you just think to yourself I just spent nearly a week making that it's very disheartening so we're going to be doing some throwing a bit more vlog material where we we just take it easy on ourselves with the editing while we get back into stuff yeah so we're going to be uh, talking about uh, stuff what's coming up and stuff what's happened uh, in, a, in and around a hobby. Um, like, uh, like Dodge said, we're going to be doing some sort of vlog stuff. Dodge has got his... Uh, converting work. Converting and work. Um, and we're not saying we're not doing painting tutorials anymore. We've got some in the bag and we will make... We will be making some. They're just not going to be as frequent because... Any anyone who runs a YouTube channel knows you got to keep feeding the algorithm, and if we just get some views clicking over again, um, so people actually see our painting tutorials when they come out, because yeah. that would that would be helpful. Uh, so some of that content to help get that algorithm going again and start throwing in a, a couple of tutorials. I mean, Andy's really knowledgeable about most of the games, so I reckon Andy. Would, yeah, yeah, he is. <laughs> I mean, I, all I see is people like other people do talk a lot of balls on vlogs and you could talk balls for days that's true um i'm just not particularly comfortable on camera um i do have a bit of a stutter which uh, gets in the way uh time to time it's escalated by camera nerves as well trying, yeah trying to give off the right impression it, it, if you keep going at it, you break through that it, it it does get escalated by the uh, camera um which just makes things a little bit more difficult but you know that's just you know minor stuff um i i do have some knowledge about what's um what's going on but a lot of it's um by virtue of i just keep my ear to the ground with uh you know other yeah. youtube channels or what gw well, are talking yeah, about but i'm always getting updated on like new data sheets and stuff um so yeah i'll be uh i will be making another video in next week and that will be sp speaking specifically about my opinion on the world eater stuff there's a lot of divided opinion uh, out there uh and i'll i'm going to be talking about it once the white dwarf's gone widely available uh, yeah. so you're not having to look at any dodgy images or uh, also um i can talk about my opinions on it because i'm a bit, bit of a world eater fan if you guys uh followed the um channel for any length of time you'll know this um do you do you regret selling that world eater army that no. you made before no no I do regret choosing to paint them white again. Yeah, but I mean, your converted army, that was awesome. The converted army was cool. Uh, but I'm doing uh, a much more uh, classic style um, berserkers this time around using the modern models. Uh, 
from the Curse Marine range. So I'll be talking about that in the next week uh, once everyone's got had a chance to have a good read through the White Dwarf as well. Hi. Uh, when it comes to White Dwarf videos, this year so far, unless we really get back on our feet here, we won't be doing those. Um, it got to a point actually where you didn't want to do them just because every single White Dwarf at that point point of the year was just boring yeah uh, it did get to a point where the white dwarfs were rubbish uh, there's nothing to review it's like, like what yeah, yeah. flick through and be like well what am I going to talk about here it's like there's it, no it was uh, it was largely just a uh, essentially a catalogue it was like an old ca- uh, it was just full of filler there was yeah. nothing going on there um, it was more of a catalogue of stuff it's like here this is the stuff we make um, so there's nothing to talk about and so those so, vid- those videos might come back again, depending on uh, depending whether, on whether we can afford the yeah with the finances or you know Games Workshop actually make the White Dwarfs worth reading. Yeah, because uh, at the moment and it, they've not been worth the money. You know. Not for a long while. Uh, there's been a couple recently, but um, for the most part, they've all been pretty uh, like luster. Uh, so we'll see. We'll see what happens with them. Yeah. What else have we got planned? Um, we won't be doing battle reports, we just do not have the space all the time. Um, unlike pay tutorials, editing a battle report, that is days and days of editing work. Again, we uh, it's, we just need to keep coming back on here and reboosting. I mean, we still get plenty of views uh, every month, which is really nice that people still watching the channel. Yeah, even great. though We've not uploaded anything. I've not painted anything since the... Was it that? About 18 months now. Oh, it's not, I can't quite be 18 months. It was the Mechanicus thing. I could have had a look. It's the Mechanicus Tech Priest. The one I painted in blue. That was the last thing I painted and uploaded. Wow. That was a while back. Long time ago. I can't remember you even painting it. Uh, yeah, um, as you guys know also, I do like to go to events. So I will be uh, also making videos post-event uh, sort of uh, analysis. Uh, what I did wrong, uh, what I did right, what you learned, what I learned, and generally how bad at the game I am, which is usually pretty poor. So don't ask me for tactical or list making advice. I like the stuff I like to use. I uh, don't necessarily use the stuff what's actually good. That is true. If you did, if I did, I might be. A, Wait, a, I wasn't might... there one tournament where the stuff you like to use it just fell in line and yes. you did really, really well? Because yes, it just it, they uh, changed some. Um, they updated some data sheets and stuff and it just happened that the stuff you like to play just happened to be the right stuff to play that, that, that yeah, tournament yeah it literally fell one and one event and that was a doubles event where everything just sort of all the missions everything just sort of fell together and we did really really well um, literally because of the stuff I used was not necessarily the the obvious stuff you take yeah which is usually the case but yeah. you go to tournaments some people go to win you just go for a laugh and a beer yeah, I generally go to uh, have a few beers with a bunch of friends and some games of 40k. Uh, so I don't take things too seriously because I'm generally a bit rubbish. Yeah. I don't know, you seem to be able to remember every single stat off the top of your head almost. It's like... I've been playing, I've been in a hobby for like 30 years. A lot of the stats haven't changed. I suppose. Well, they change and they change back. Yeah. So it gets easy. Yeah, that's fair enough. I will probably be sticking with some converting work. Um bases that people buy off us all the time if you remember there's hundreds of them in front of me right now the other ones are nearly done yay very nearly done I've nearly caught up on all the sets all the way through all the ovals and then I've just got 80s 100s and 120 circles to do for all six sets before I build it out so with the steps I'm at I'm going to finish what is it tiled MK2 all the oval sizes and shapes and uh, I'm going to do some converting work on my own army because how many years I've been working in a studio with you and been like, I want to do my own stuff. I've not been able to Since do much of it. Yeah. Um, but I mean, the, the title so I might still start vlogging just updates yeah. on the Warg Decay and just like stop carrying on with my Nurgle Orc army. So let us know if you guys want to see a bunch of that because... Uh, there is tons for me to build and convert, so I can easily vlog that as well as make some converting tutorials. And I will be picking up the paintbrush again, so that'll be its own video. Picking up the paintbrush after over a year. Let's see how well I can paint now. I'm sure you'll be fine. 
Fuck me. Hopefully, hopefully the um, the practice. Wish my phone had shut up while we're recording. Uh, hopefully, all the practice I've had, muscle memory will stick, and I can pick it back up pretty quick. I'm sure you'll be fine. Um, uh, sometimes a break's as good as uh, a rest, as good as an, um, just stopping. Uh, yeah, maybe. But it's, uh, a, a year. A year. Out of practice, it's quite out of practice a long time. you might have, you might take a little bit of. Uh, well, I won't paint any model that I want to keep. Then I'll just start with something rubbish. Start with something simple. Yeah, maybe paint some ogre in or something. Cause they're always fun. Yeah. So, uh, also, guys, what do you want us to start uh, start doing? Um, is there any content what you'd like us to uh, get on with? Um, what we haven't mentioned. Yeah, uh, we're up for ideas. Um, we're going to be bringing them. Obviously, we're trying to bring this channel back to life a bunch. So. Let us know what you want and see if we can work on that while we work on everything else. Yeah, I think we're all out of... We're all out of move. All, all out of out things of, to say. All out of things to say, yeah, so we're... Uh, That's not too bad. So, I will give a big thank you for the patrons that supported us even when we were not uploading or, you know, doing anything really on there. You guys, you really helped to keep this channel going. Um, you really did. Yeah, man. Um, and thanks for everyone who keeps watching anyway even though we've not been doing anything so hopefully more content soon but it'll just be a slightly different style yeah. and a bit less well a bit more regular than it has been because we've not been on a year yeah but a bit more casual as well yeah probably a bit more casual rather than taking it all too seriously us, again as we've said before you guys uh, who've seen us since day one you know we're, we're, ty- we're not the most serious of fellas uh, we want to enjoy the channel as much as you guys do. Aye. So that's what we're gonna. Um, that's the direction we want to be heading. We want to be less professional, more ourselves. Yeah, and well, I think hopefully that will come across kind of well. It's, we've been kind of been rugged with these videos, and we're kind of like, um, what is it? Just really stiff and not really being ourselves. But being on camera, it's just, it's just weird like that. Yeah. So I think that's all from us. So we'll catch you in the next one, whichever video that might be. Catch you later. Later.